Hi, everybody. Sure. Hope you're having a great Friday. It's a beautiful day. Yeah, we got a little bit more sunshine today than what we saw yesterday, and that's really going to be the story into the evening. As high pressure builds in, as we get into the upcoming weekend, we're talking about some hotter weather to work its way back into the area. So it's kind of been nice to see this little taste of false fall, if you will. But this ridge of high pressure is going to build in and bring us quite a bit more heat, especially as we get into our Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday time frame. So for the rest of the day today, plenty of sunshine, not much to show you on a future cast model. We'll see a few more clouds developing across the mountains and the plateau, but the central and southern valleys should see plenty of sunshine throughout the majority of our afternoon and evening. Forecast high temperatures back close to those seasonal averages will be in the mid to upper 80s. Dew points not too terribly high. And so, yeah, a little bit higher than the last couple of days, but still making for a nice evening and not much of a heat index value by eight o'clock. We're now gonna be sitting right around 80 degrees. So the weekend, a little bit warmer, more seasonable weather. Average highs for this time of year are in the upper 80s. So we may be trending at or slightly above average both Saturday and Sunday. Uh, and that's really going to be the story here for the next few days. Dew points will gradually climb, but more so as we get into the middle part of next week. And so that's going to allow uh, our heat index values to increase just a little bit as well because... As I mentioned, we've got that ridge of high pressure building on in. That's going to allow our temperatures to be in the low to mid-90s. Through the weekend and the start of next week, you add higher dew points come Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and heat index values will reflect that as well. So we'll be in the upper 90s to low 100s for those heat index values next week. And not a lot of precipitation. Maybe another storm system next Wednesday, Thursday, Friday time frame-ish. So make sure you check back in. But a perfect lake and pool weekend ahead. We're staying rain-free all the way through Sunday. We'll stay rain-free all the way through Tuesday. And then Wednesday, Thursday, we might start to add or introduce a little bit more rain to the area, which will lead because we're going to be trending on the drier side, average to drier side as we wrap up the month of August and start the month of September. And you combine that with hotter than average weather. And that's going to be kind of a recipe for disaster as we get into September and October, our two driest months of the year. So you can check it every single day. Easy to do so with the East Tennessee Weather app. It's a free app download from your app store. Just search East TN Weather, all one word. Look for the orange TN and the white lightning bolt. Forecast weather updates, current conditions. And when we need the interactive radar, it'll be a great tool for that as well because it gives you past, current, and future radar all of uh, two hours. So a great, uh, great thing to have right there in your back pocket. By the way, I'm also raising money for a great cause. Okay. So if you've not seen this or heard this, it's at the top of the app. I've got a link there for you to donate or also online at easttnweather.com on the website. I'm raising money for the American Cancer Society. Yes, uh, we're raising money for a great cause, breast cancer awareness and research here in East Tennessee, but also it's a little bit of a competition. So Something to kind of keep in mind uh, if you are, are wanting to donate. Again, I am raising money for the American Cancer Society. So uh, I would love for your donation, whether it be 50 cents a dollar or if you could do it more than that, that would be greatly appreciated. Just again, the link is at the top of the app and, of course, online at easttnweather.com. You've probably seen it on social media as well. All right. Happy Friday, everybody. Have a great rest of your afternoon. Your next weather update is coming up at 5 and by f at 530 tonight, we will be broadcasting live on East Tennessee Weather. Uh, in Hamblin County at the Burke Tony Stadium for the big old East West game going on in Hamblin County here tonight. Just come say hi if you're going to be around. I'll be at the Farm Bureau uh, bright red tent. But again, we'll be broadcasting live on East Tennessee weather at 530 this evening. I hope you check in.